Wow. Oh my god. Please, Australia, please send this song to Eurovision Song Contest. Mmm. Good day, mates, and welcome back to my channel. It's your boy, Renzi Benzi. Today, we're going to make another reaction video, and this time, we're going to fly all the way down to land down under, which is Australia. So I think my accent is already, um, it's heck Hawaii. <laughs> anyway, so, um, this Feb 26 will be the Australia Decides 2022, which will be held at Gold Coast. Um, that's the natural selection for the um, Australian entry for the Eurovision Song Contest 2022. There will be 11 entries for this national selection and whoever wins will obviously represent Australia for this upcoming Eurovision Song Contest 2022 which will be held at Turin, Italy this May. So I'm going to react to this one song that is quite a crowd favorite. So without further ado, let's make a reaction video to it. Let's go. Just a quick disclaimer, I'm going back to my usual American accent because I know that my Australian accent is quite cringy. So, yeah, everyone's ready. Here we go. Play. I was told at six years old, oh. me if my heart was cold. Another my heart piano ballad. Mm -hmm. They never liked the things that I would like. Cause you're told to play, but you're not the same as the other kids Ugh, playing the same what a game. Voice. Try to jump on in, but they push away so far away. I'm not the same. No. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not the same. No. Uh, wow. I wish I had that kind of voice, you know. Try and try. My father asked me if today I smiled. I said yes, I did, but that's a lie. Now there are strings accompanying the piano. Very good. When you run and hide, hide the break inside. Do you realize that the light shines bright through the Oh, damn. You know, his voice is very whole and I don't know how to explain this, but it's full of emotions. It's, ah, uh, goosebumps, <laughs> goosebumps alert. <laughs> oh, wow, those high notes. Not the same by Sheldon Riley. Sheldon, Sheldon, Sheldon. Wow. <laughs> to be honest, I'm out of words. I don't know what to react, but obviously this song is a banger. We now have a clear winner at Australia Decides 2022. I mean, like, come on. Australia, you have one job to do. Send this song to Eurovision Song Contest and I assure you, you'll place you really, really high. I'm placing my best of this song because it's full of emotions. It's, you know, Sheldon Riley is a very good performer. Like he's, he's one of the best. Like I've seen some of his performances when he was still auditioning at The Voice and 
and X Factor, correct me if I'm wrong, but it's a reality show. But anyway, I've seen some of his performances and he is the Sheldon Riley. Like he's not trying to emulate other artists. He's trying to be himself. Sheldon is one of those few artists who um, would try to make a name out of it from the start. <laughs> I remember when I first heard Arcade, I had the same feels as well. It's a bittersweet song. This song not the same, however, it does not talk about unrequited love. It's more like being yourself and not to care about what people think about you. It's just as long as you don't cross the boundaries, as long as you remain true to yourself, that's what matters the most, especially in today's time. <sighs> please, Australia, please send this song to Eurovision Song Contest. Mm. Australians, please, please, please vote for this song. You have one job to do. <laughs> I mean, obviously I'm out of words. I don't know how to to put all of my feelings into words. I'm, it's, it's just indescribable, you know? I mean, it's so beautiful. Like, beautiful is not the appropriate adjective to describe this this song. I mean, we, ha we have seen some ballad piano as well, like Christian Amund's River is also good, but this one, I am really excited how Sheldon Riley performs at the grand stage. I've seen Sheldon Riley perform. It's, it's so Eurovision. And I remember when he was interviewed back in maybe X Factor or The Voice. Again, correct me if I'm wrong. His ultimate goal was to represent Australia at Eurovision Song Contest to present something at the big stage at the Eurovision. And I think he's going to make it. I think he's going to win it. <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> I don't know, but this song is just one of the best. You see, Australia is one of the countries that I always look forward, especially in Eurovision, because they always send um, great songs, especially like back in 2016 when Danny Im represented Australia for the Eurovision Song Contest at Stockholm, Sweden. Her song, Sound of Silence, was one of the best. It was Australia's actually best entry yet. So I guess this song will actually overtake the Sound of Silence. I know I'm just being very optimistic when it comes to this song, but I don't know. We have a winner. <laughs> so do you think this song will stand a chance to win Australia Decides 2022 and eventually represent Australia this coming Eurovision Song Contest 2022 at Turin, Italy this May? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I would love to hear it from you guys. So, if you like this video, don't forget to click the like and subscribe buttons, as well as the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to know that I have new content here on YouTube. Once again, this is your boy Renzi Benzi saying adios amigos, stay safe, bye bye